Tonight, plans to form a new city is in East Cobb County are getting new attention. This week, as the citizens group behind it all beefs up the committee it's formed, the new city proposal would have borders just northeast of Marietta. Our Haley Mason is talking to people for and against that plan tonight. Dozens of residents here in Marietta are trying to prove that their plan for a new city will work, but county leadership right now is not convinced. District 2 in East Cobb County has grown exponentially over the years, but some residents say the services have not grown enough. They want more police presence and overall better representation. One group believes they can do it themselves by forming a new city just northeast of Smyrna and Marietta. The big thing for me was representation. You know, we currently have one part-time commissioner uh, representing about 185,000 people. The East Cobb Cityhood Group had Georgia State University complete this feasibility study. It says a new city would spend about $45 million each year in operating costs, but would earn nearly $50 million in revenue. So we're in the process of building a finance committee um, that's actually going to go line by line through this study and to really bring the study to life. The cityhood group wants to prove they can do it all without raising taxes, but Cobb County Chairman Mike Boyce says he hasn't seen any numbers that signal the citizens group is prepared. Someone asked them about the kind of fire department they were going to have, and they, they, they had no answer to that. So that tells me that they have not dug deeply enough into what it really going to require to provide the services that they say uh, that they want the city to provide. The Powers Ferry Corridor Alliance invited the cityhood group to a large public meeting this week to flesh out the ideas. We will definitely be impacted as a, as a community group. They say their business district will split in two if a new city is formed. People are still concerned about will their taxes go up? How do they plan to do this financially? And uh, I think the cityhood group is going to work on refining their message. Cobb County's chairman Mike Boyce tells me that none of the other local cities here are able to operate at a lower millage rate than the county offers. Still a lot of conversation to be fleshed out as this continues to pick up steam. Reporting in East Cobb, Haley Mason, CBS 46 News.